Hey guys, welcome to Rudra Tech Tutorials. Objective of this video is to understand what is a decorator and also to understand what is at the rate ng module decorator and what is its use within Angular. Well, a decorator is a special declaration that can be attached to a class, method, property or a parameter. Decorator defines the intent and stores the metadata about the class method property or a parameter that is the decorator is a special function that will tell us that what is this class about and how it is going to behave there are four types of decorators class decorator example ng module or at the red component method decorators like at the red host listener property decorators like at the red input and parameter decorators like at the rect inject and in future video we will be seeing more and more decorators in detail but in this video we are going to see at the rect ng module decorator and the reason i have introduced the decorators here because at the rect ng module decorator is a class decorator and each angular application has at least one at the red ng module decorator now this at the red ng module decorator is always associated with a typescript class which is a app module class in this case the at the red ng module decorator tells the compilers that this particular class is a module and it will have certain metadata like the declarations the declarations is a array of components pipes or directives that are associated with this particular module then is imports the imports are the array of the feature module or library modules now the feature modules are the modules that are also at the red ng module but are used within another module like this app routing module this is another at the rate ng module but it is used within the app module hence it is considered as a feature module then there is a library module the library module is core functionality of angular and it is used to enhance our applications functionalities so this imports array will provide you an array of feature and library modules then is the providers array it tells or informs the module about the injectable services that are used with it and all the injectable services have to be registered with these providers in order to make sure that they are available within this module then is the exports array this metadata defines the components pipes or directives that can be exported from the given module this feature is useful when the particular module is used as a feature module and you want to export a component or a pipe or a directive from the given module to the parent module then is entry components the entry components is a set of components to compile when the ng module is defined so that they can be dynamically loaded into the view then is the bootstrap the bootstrap is a set of components that are bootstrap when the module is bootstrap that is when the module has started execution so these are the limited set of metadata with ng module that i have defined and in future we'll be seeing more of them and do remember the ng module is the most important decorator within the angular application it holds the central position and app module is always the root module for our application so this video defines the ng module in detail i hope you have liked this video do like it do subscribe it and thank you